When one dies and is buried in the ground, theoretically, you are actually closer to hell than you are to heaven. I started thinking about what if that instead of the idea that uh, has always been portrayed about when you die that you're you go through the pearly gates and that you know you may, may have to stand before God and He judges you there. What if instead you actually went through hell first. What if you had to stand before the devil, before Satan, before Lucifer, before whatever name you give him? Of course, I'm going to, you know, take it from from an aspect that indeed exists. So this would be for those people of religions who who believe in a punishment by God, who believes in hell, Satan, punishment, you know, things of that nature. Christians, Muslims, some other religions. So let's say, what if you had to stand before Satan and it was Satan that judged you? You had to... Be eligible. Prove yourself worthy of making it to heaven. Instead of starting there and being judged to be kicked out. No, you have to start in hell. And prove that you are worthy to go to heaven. And I thought about this. I thought about that Satan would, would come at you. Greater than any prosecutor could, any judge could. That he would be able to break your life down. That he would know the Bible better than any Christian. He would know the Quran better than any Muslim. He would know any holy book of any people better than those who say, profess, believe in a specific religion. And he will come at you, ultimately, with truth. He can't do anything but come at you with truth. He would examine your life in truth. Once again, he couldn't do anything else because, ultimately, if there is a God and there is a Satan, and you have to, once again, free yourself from hell. God in essence would be overseeing in some manner. So say you want to be able to lie about you. Lie about the things that you did. Lie about these books. In order to try to keep you there because your God won't allow that. So Satan could, would, and only be able to judge you in truth. And I thought about this, the irony of that. That actually, at the end of the day, it would be the devil, that trickster, who would be more truthful than you. Who would doom you to his realm, his domain, through truth. Greater than you would. He would speak truth more than you did. He would see truth better than you did. He would know truth better than you did. He would be truth better than you were. Man, would that be something?